Serious concerns tonight over safety in school. Only ABC Action News obtaining exclusive video of an intense knife fight today at King High School. Our Edward Lawrence joins us live outside the school with why some students say violence seems to be so common out there. Edward? And tonight, the school is quiet, but this stabbing happened here at King High School outside in a courtyard just outside the front doors. It had the school on lockdown for the first period. Caught on video, a fight that started because of social media. <laughs> Students tell ABC Action News two sets of relatives started fighting over a boy before school. Students say the disagreement started because of some posts on Instagram. It escalated when Hillsborough County Sheriff's deputies say one sophomore pulled a two-inch knife and started stabbing. You can see glimpses of it in her right hand in the video as she stabs downward. They're having a lot of people that don't want to come to school because of that. So. And you're leaving because of it? Yeah. <laughs> Kiana Eady says her mother had enough of fights at King High School. Kiana says she is moving to Clearwater next month to concentrate on her education at another school without fear of getting involved in a fight. I think they should just like start searching more instead of worrying about what we're wearing, maybe searching what we have. Jasmine Johnson agrees, saying fighting takes away from her education. Like you have to be aware, aware of your surroundings because this person want to fight you, that person want to fight you. You never know. Jasmine says fights happen about every week, either on campus or just off school grounds. The victims of the latest fight, two juniors, were stabbed near the eye, in the chest, and on the shoulder. They got stitches and will survive. The school resource officer arrested the two sophomores who started the fight and pulled the knife. And a Hillsborough County school spokesperson says that this uh, King High School is not a problem school and a fight can break out at any school. He adds that the two sophomores who were arrested in this case will not be back at this school. Reporting live in Hillsborough County, Edward Lawrence, ABC Action News.